and let's say this picks up here for 300 bucks you pick it up here and the dump is here you just dump it right there let's say it costs you 20 bucks to dump that's 280 dollar profit man this is like my favorite favorite business model i was going to get into this before um before the pandemic happened and and and, and then i was like you know what i started looking into the box truck game but In this video, I'm going to show you how to start a cargo van business. I'm going to show you five ways that you can keep the van running. And I'm going to show you exactly where you can find the, the cargo van where you can rent it for $300 a week with unlimited miles. I don't think you're going to find a, a van that cheap anywhere. So let's dive into this. As you can see, I'm in my, um, I'm in my website, Box Truck Life with a Y. Um, the first thing you need to do, is you're going to need a van. You know, a lot of people have their own cargo vans. Um, but if you don't have it, I'm going to show you how to rent it. I know it's kind of tough, you know, to find a box truck. So I'm going to give you this option here that you can do. Maybe you can save the money to buy a one outright. And even then, you know, use they're, they're going for so much. I mean, I've seen people posting 80, 80 grand, 70 grand for a used box truck. So it's ridiculous. Even the rentals are hard to get. It takes a month or two just to get on the waiting list and wait for something to come up. So this is a viable business that you can actually start for cheap. It's going to cost you under 500 bucks a week to do this and i'm going to show you how to stay busy with it so the first thing you're going to do do is to find the the van now if you go to the rental places they're going to give you uh they're going to give you a ridiculous price for these vans so you have to go through a third party and the third party i use is priceline.com i'm sure a lot of you guys are, are familiar with it um what you do is you click the car click the car i'm sorry and you're going to hit your uh, your destination where you're picking it up or your pickup point and right here we're going to do some random we'll do 16 and then uh the drop off a week later would be the 23rd and you're going to hit find your car this is going to take uh this is going to take a minute this thing is pretty slow okay so it loaded all the stuff um what are you going to do you're going to take this and filter it click van only and it's going to show you all the vans that are available these are regular vans as you can see uh we need a cargo van or truck okay so here's three of them as you can see the price is 34 dollars a day i mean that's cheap you're not gonna, it's cheaper than the cars first of all cheaper than the cars so what you do is you're going to choose which one you want if you pay it ahead of time you're going to pay 34 dollars a day which is a steal it's 257 dollars total that's what the fees comes with unlimited miles now if you want to pay for it later it has free cancellation so what you do is you sign up you book it and when you get to the counter you pay it it's going to cost more obviously because that's how they do their uh that's how they do business but it's still going to be 302 dollars if you decide not to pay it ahead of time so we're going to go with the pay now and no we don't want a hotel and as you can see here the price is 256.78 total it's 237 for the truck it, it's one week rental and it comes with unlimited mileage you're not going to find a deal like that anywhere you're not going to find a deal like that anywhere and um all you do is just pay for it you sign up right here pay for it down here put your bill in and you're good to go once you, all you have to do is go pick it up on the day that you shut it off now if you don't want to pay ahead of time you can you can still book this you book it and you're going to pay 302 dollars when you get there to the window which is still it's still good it's still a great price because that's like about like 40 bucks a day uh total for unlimited miles and you're going to make more than 40 dollars to to pay for this so if it was me i would just go with the you know the pay now 256 dollars this is cheaper than cars so this is how you get your van it's going to be under 300 bucks it's just you're not going to find it nowhere else so make sure you go to priceline to do this don't book it from the regular site because then you're going to pay like 100 and some dollars a day and it's going to make it harder to turn a, a good profit so now we're going to go back to my site all right so the first place you're going to sign up for i'm going to put this link in the thing so you can just click on this and uh it'll take you straight to the site so the first thing is shipley shipley is a place where people post loads you know it could be anything it could be water it could be paper it could be machinery from factories to company it could be furniture appliances motorcycles cars all kinds of stuff so once you get here this is the sign up page i'm going to go to the main page so you can see exactly what they are um 
they have this in the UK and they, they have this in the United States. So you're going to want to set this for the United States. As you can see here, I'm going to play this video real quick so you can see, have an idea of what they do. Um, it's a marketplace. You know, a bit you in want something, you want something well, heavy or unusual, or unusual delivered, delivered, but you don't want like to spend hours and hours or directors, or directors and calling up companies, and calling up companies only to get only expensive, to get expensive quotes. quotes. At Shipley, At Shipley we help you get, help free, you get quotes free quotes from thousands, from thousands of reliable, of reliable customer rated delivery companies. companies. Prices are low, Prices are up, low. To up to 75% of standard, standard rates. This is because, this is because delivery companies compete against each other to find work along their existing routes. All you have to All do, you have is, to list do is list your delivery request, request on, the site, on the site and quotes will, and be, quotes emailed will be emailed to you. you. You can then view all the quotes you receive in one place. In one place. Check, prices Check prices and customer, and feedback, customer feedback to make the best, make the best decision, decision and choose the and quote, that's, the right quote that's right for you. Shipley, Shipley your, delivery. your delivery. Multiple. Multiple. Yeah, as you can see, they, they deliver all kinds of stuff here. Um, uh, as you can see here, they have couches, jet skis, boats. This stuff right here, you can just latch it to the to the, the back of the van or the tr yeah the back of the van and haul this yourself. This is uh, all these vans have uh, where you can haul it um, to sign up. Where's the sign up page? Well, let's search shipments real quick so I can show you the load board. Um, as you can see, they ship all kinds of stuff here. This is looks like a entertainment center, uh, bikes, cast iron fireplace. whatever this is it's just like a fireplace it's all kinds of stuff you don't have to go uh over the road to do this you can do this locally you can do an hour two hours three hours away you just have to set up your uh your filters and let's say you let's say you're picking up a pallet of water from a from a big box store and it's going about 45 minutes away let's say you bid 100 to 120 dollars for that you can pick up another load that's going in that same area it doesn't have to go to the same area but you can parcel this stuff out and you can do this all day long. This is like the first thing that I, I want you to sign up for because they have, they have actually have good uh, van loads here. And this is all locally. Everything I'm going to show you here is locally. You're not going to be going over the road unless you want to, but I wouldn't recommend it because you can just make uh, five, six hundred dollars a day uh, just by doing this stuff uh, locally. Now the next thing I'm going to need you to sign up for is called Roadie. Now Roadie, it's it's a, it's like a gig. Um, everything is an app. And since you're going to have a cargo van, you're going to be able to haul big loads. They have a lot of uh, cheap loads. Let's say there's like a part, you know, from the auto parts store, you know, for like 10 bucks or something or 15 bucks. I haven't done this in a while, so I don't, I don't know the exact prices. But with a van, you can go pick up big stuff from like uh, Lowe's, um, Home Depot, Ace, uh, big box stores. And you can fill the van and the loads are actually a lot more money, so. The bigger the load, the money, the more the money you you're gonna have. Now, this I would use as a like a supplement to the to the Shipley app. So let's say you're in a place you deliver a bunch of stuff over there uh, for Shipley, and you just open this up and see if there's a load going back to where you want to go, which is usually your area, your home. Open this up, look and see what loads are available, and if the money's right, you take it. This is worth signing up for. Like I said, there there's a lot of cheap loads on there for like cars and stuff. You know, like a little part or a little car part or battery or something. But since you're going to have a van, you're going to be able to pick up the big loads, you know, like the bricks, uh, uh, appliances, uh, wood, drywall or, or whatever. So make sure you sign up for this to supplement the, the shipments on, um, on Shipley. And then the next thing I'm going to need you to sign up for is called Amazon Flex. Now, Amazon Flex is it's like the packages that you get at home. You know, I'm sure everybody orders. Uh, the packages, you know, those little plastic bags, the boxes, and all that other stuff. And this is what Amazon Flex is, but it's like, uh, it's for third parties, you know, for people like us. You can do this in your car, but since you have a cargo van, you're going to be able to take the big blocks, which are like five hours. Now, the blocks never take the time that they're supposed to be. Let, let's say it's five hour block. It's probably going to take like three hours to do. And what you do is you go to the warehouse, you pick up the packages, and it's gonna be like everything is in the app and you just drop off the package it's gonna be like boom 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 in the same area and once you're done with that then um, you can go back and get another block or you can do the other gigs like I showed you now Amazon flex is pretty it's pretty popular so if your city's not on here you have to come in here check every single day just because you know like I said it's popular these these things go quick the sign up goes quick all you need is a license uh, a driver's license well I'm not gonna download the app because I already have it so 
uh, you just need your, your, your driver's license. You need regular uh, car insurance. You need to be 21 years and over. Here's the list of the cities right here. Here's where you're going to see if there's some in your cities. Like I said, this is pretty popular. It comes and goes real quick. And you can do this in a regular car. As you can see, Ohio's gone. I'm signed up for this in the Cleveland area. I did this like four or five years ago. And I did it in a regular van. And I made a, a ton of money. I got my my cousin to do this. And he does this all the time. And he makes like twelve, thirteen hundred $1,300 a week. You know, just doing it in his car. He's got like a little... Uh, little honda or something but you're gonna do it with a van you can you can do the bigger ones the the four and the five hour routes now the thing about this is now that they have same day delivery now they're they're offering uh deliveries at like four in the morning if you can get up uh early and and pick up a, a block at four in the morning you can easily make 170 180 dollars before eight o'clock in the morning so if you want to start early you pick up a, a, a four hour block a five hour block at four in the morning you go, you deliver it. Once you deliver the packages, you scan them, you know, right there. Once you scan them all and you're done delivering, you're done for that day. You can go back to go pick up more loads and you can do this all day long, but I wouldn't do it. What I would do is come out at four in the morning, uh, do these loads. You get like 180, 190, depending if it's raining or snowing, the, the blocks go up uh, naturally. And and then I'll go do the, the Shipley during the morning to the day to the afternoon, the Shipley and the Rody. But if you just wanted to do the Amazon packages, they have uh, loads all day. All you do is open up the app and it's going to show you a list of, uh, of blocks. They're called blocks. There's three hour blocks, four hour blocks, five hour blocks. So you're going to take the five hour blocks because it has the bigger packages and there's more packages it's going to take up uh, more room. Now, this is something to sign up for Amazon Flex. So the next thing I'm going to I'm going to have you do is junk removal business. Now, this is my favorite business model. This is what I was going to do before I got into the box truck business. Um, what you do is, is, is you pick up, uh, junk, you know, people are always cleaning out the garages. They're cleaning out, the, uh, the shed, excuse me. They're cleaning out the sheds. They're cleaning, you know, they're doing remodeling the bathroom and they might have a pile of, uh, of drywall sinks and all kinds of stuff. So before you even get into this, you're going to find, uh, you're going to find your, uh, your local dumps. So you're gonna to go to Google and do refuse near me. And it's gonna show you all the dumping sites in your area. So you click more places. I don't know why my computer is acting up today. And it's gonna show you all the dumping sites in your area. It's gonna be on the map here. And it'll be, if you look over here, they're all listed here. You're gonna call all these places cause you're definitely gonna to wanna to know uh, the prices. You make a list of this stuff and and you get them all, call them all, because you might have a, a load that picks up here and you want to dump it close to here. You don't want to be coming from here, picking up a load here and then coming all the way across town to dump it. So call all these places and find out uh, what you can dump. You know, some of these places you can't dump paint, chemicals, obviously, uh, you know, batteries and stuff like that. So find, they're going to give you a list of what you can and you can dump. Now, the good thing about this is dumping, it's, it could be like $19, $17 to dump a van full of uh of stuff and like i said it's not always you know it's different it's not always going to be a full van it's you know you can just pick up a bunch of uh old buckets somebody clean out the garage you know has a bunch of just garbage you know and this is not regular garbage that we put on the street but you know like uh old tvs or something you know old radios clean out the garage and uh clean out the shed you know they might just tear down the room tear down the wall have a bunch of drywall or just you know in the yard they do yard cleaning you have a big pile of wood and, and stuff like that so you're gonna call all of these and you're gonna make a list and put the number uh, for the and the location for these things and you're gonna find out exactly what you can dump I mean because most of them are the same but some like I said some of these places you can't dump paint so obviously you're not gonna um, you're not gonna you're not gonna haul paint so the next thing you're gonna do is go to Craigslist here's where you're gonna find your business you can put this on Facebook marketplaces so you're gonna put it on Facebook marketplace and you're gonna put it on, on Craigslist and you're gonna go in here every day and update it because you want to go towards the top so we're gonna search services put junk removal oops this is gonna be junk removal you can see everybody's doing this I mean, this is like my favorite business model. Now, 
if you can get yourself a, a, a dumper where you can uh, just dump this stuff and just throw it in there, it'll be a lot better. If you're gonna use your van, buy like a big tarp, they're like 20 bucks or 15 bucks in Walmart or Harbor Freight and you just lay it in the van. And then when you get to the dump, you take out all the big stuff, throw it in the dump and then you just slide the, the, the tarp just to get the rest off and then you're, you're on to the next job. Um, what you do is you're gonna click here, you're gonna click post. Once you get to the junk removal center and you're gonna put it as gig offered or service offered right here. And you're just going to put your ad. Make sure you put this every day. Make sure you put it, uh, it says there's a limit here. You can put it every 48 hours. I know people get around this limit, but you just keep posting it. So you can go back to the top and then go to Facebook Marketplace and make sure you, you post this. And people are going to start calling. Now, when you call, um, how are you going to estimate the, the stuff? Is people are going to send you a picture? You're going to ask for a picture of what needs to be picked up and dumped. The only thing is you have to actually pick up the stuff. Usually they're in a pile. People just pile them out. And you just go in there, pick it up, dump it. You could be in and out in 10, 15 minutes, depending on how big the, the you know, the, the stuff they want to dump. Let's say somebody calls you, you say, hey, send me a picture. You look at the picture, make sure it fits inside the van, make sure it's not, uh, you know, nothing that, you know, that's on the do not dump list. And you just pick it up. Let's say you quote them 300 bucks. You go in there, you pick it up. If it's something you need help with, hire a brother, a sister, a brother, sister, cousin, or somebody, pay them 100 bucks a day, 150 bucks a day. And you can do this all day long. You don't even have to do the Shipley, the Amazon, or the Roadie. You can just do this all long and make good money. So let's say you do a $300 load, pick up a bunch of bricks or, or a drywall or something uh, out in the yard. You put this in a van. You take it to the local dump. Remember I said call all the call all the dumps because, like I said, these are going to be different around your city. You're not going to be picking up everything in the same place. And let's say this picks up here for 300 bucks. You pick it up here and the dump is here. You just dump it right there. Let's say it costs you 20 bucks to dump. That's $280 profit, man. This is like my favorite, favorite business model. I was going to get into this before um, before the pandemic happened. And, and, and then I was like, you know what? I started looking into the box truck game. But, you know, if I had to do something, and I might still do this. I just won't do it myself. I might just go buy a, a dumper and then, uh, you know, hire some family to, to go do the picking up. But this is like the best thing you can do. Uh, with a van, like I said, if you can get a, a, a dump, uh, a dumper for this, it'll be a lot better, but you can still do it in the van. And the next thing that I need you to sign up for, well, it's not signed up for. Now, this is furniture delivery. This is usually done in a box truck, but you can still do it in a van. So what you need to do is get a bunch of business cards. Um, you know, you can get them out. I forgot what's that place called. Um, Vista print, or you can do them anywhere. You can even do them locally, get some uh, business cards. And then get yourself an outfit, go to Amazon, buy one of those dicky suits. Uh, the, you know, like an outfit, they're like blue or, or black or brown. And just like, you know, just dress like a delivery person. You know, they got patches there you can do. Put your name on a patch, put your company name on the other side. And walk into all these stores. Let me see. So we're going to go furniture store. That Fortnite. So you're gonna go furniture stores near me. Man, this is slow. And you're gonna have all these uh, the show or stores that that show up in your area. Now, instead of calling these, I would just go in there. Uh, like I said, get a uniform, get like a dicky suit, put your name and tag in there, and then come with your van and and talk to the manager. Ask for the manager or the owner. And there's a lot of stuff that's not on here. These are like the popular ones. Um, but there's a lot of little mom and pop stores that don't show up on here. Um, matter of fact, most of them won't show up on here. And you just go in there, you give them your business card, say, hey, you know, if you have a delivery uh, for furniture appliances, this is a van, show them the van. You know, sometimes people want the, sh the, the deliveries the same day. Now, like I said, they prefer to have a box truck, you know, where you could just throw, you could throw all these deliveries in there and do them all on the same day. But that's not always the case. You know, people come in, they'll pay extra to get that same day delivery. And just give them your business card say this is what i do you know if you have any deliveries and they'll, they'll work with you because they don't pay uh they don't pay for the delivery you know people come order furniture it's a separate fee to have a delivery and so they'll definitely work with you this is not something i want to do because i just don't i don't like going into people's houses and i don't want to sit there and and put uh, uh furniture together or, or put uh, appliances together but this is another option to have i mean it's always good to have options and all five of these business models, it's, uh, you know, 
you're still your own boss you know it's like you know you, you work on your own time you make your own hours this is a little bit different because then, then they'll start calling you every day and they'll say hey you know have this 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 so you know like i said it's not my favorite business model to do but this is something you can do so i'm going to recap what you're going to what you have to do here go to priceline uh do the the rental for the van and then you're going to sign up for shipley here's where you're going to get most of your orders because these are this is where you're going to have your biggest orders and the best paying orders is through shipley and then you're going to have Brody. Brody, it's a same, it's another shipping thing but it's usually for um you know like big box stores and and home improvement so let's say you go drop off some water or or something in one city you just open up the roadie and see if there's something there to take you back to where you want to go and you just throw that in the van and go home amazon flex is another you can do this all day i wouldn't do it all day i would just take a four in the morning uh load before everybody's up and and just do those and by the time eight o'clock hits around you're done you know the money they pay twice a week uh they play what was it tuesdays and fridays and they always have load. amazon is just so big they always have loads for you and these are packages you know boxes um uh, those little plastic packages and, and it's just boom 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 you know it's you know it's all in the app and then the junk removal business this is my favorite business models uh this right here you know just go to craigslist uh to do it every day post your ad and you're going to start getting calls and go to facebook marketplace that's another place where you want to post it and people are going to start calling when they send you the picture just say look this is what i'm going to do uh this is what i'm going to you know quote you and just go pick it up and just dump it i mean dumping fees are so so low i mean you'd be surprised but make sure you call them all ahead of time get that list of what you can and can't take um some some places might say hey, we don't take wood i don't know why but you know just just do that and then um and then the furniture delivery like i said it's not my favorite uh thing to do but you know if it's if you need if you're not as you know if you want if this is something you you want to do where you can go to people's houses and if you have a box truck you can actually do this with a box truck if you have a box truck it would be better because then you can get contracts you can get two hundred thousand dollars a year contract and for those two hundred thousand a year you're gonna have to you're gonna have to pay for fuel uh maintenance you're gonna have to hire somebody because you're not gonna be able to you know to take refrigerators and um uh, couches and stuff up in the apartments um but you can make good money i mean this is not something i would do but this is another option so there's five these are five options you can do you can find a van for under 300 bucks you're not going to find it anywhere and and do this and you're going to stay busy but the only thing is you have to follow through a lot of people don't follow through uh with stuff but this is actually a viable business model um this is something that i've done and was planning to do before i got into the box truck game but this is something like i said it's something you can do now instead of you know waiting around for a truck or waiting to save money for a truck and and this is something you can do so i'll put this in the link you know you can just click go through the go to the post and it'll take you to everywhere where you need to uh to sign up for this stuff so i'm gonna let you go the video's long sorry for all the all the stuttering and all this other stuff and the lagging but this is a good business model so you guys have a good one